This is just a co total quick teaser video. That's it. No pertinent info other than it's the best sounding tin hi-fi or tin audio that I've ever heard. And I graphed all of them and two of these in particular are really, really good. Why do companies get popular? Because they listen to feedback, they don't have issues, and if they do, they take care of them quickly. And thus, a popular brand is born, and that they did that. And apparently, they listened to some of the people that said they thought that it was kind of a little bit bright. And giving a brief description, it's got a rise from one to two that's very not too steep, and then it's got a plateau like treble that's very popular right now it's not that harm and bump it's more of a flat extension two versions are probably going to be released one goes to about 8k very stable shelf from about two a slight dip at four gets to eight and then falls away with a 16 peak and then the other one has the same rise but a little lower continues on falls away at around 8k or just before 8k and then has a couple two to three post 8k peaks which gives some people they believe like myself that there's the end of the energy from cymbals and some guitar notes and other stuff kind of exists there completes the sonic event so they're probably going to release two versions um, neither one of them being a, a spiky bright one of these was very similar to what would be probably the one that I didn't like the most because it had a very obnoxious spike. None of these have that. One of them's very close to that. And two of these sound brilliant. And what is that? I don't know. Shh. shh, shh. And I'm out.